It's done now for the Peter Channel Lady News on this Wednesday evening, October 12th, 2016. Good evening, everybody. I'm Peter Wiggins now. Your evening news at 9 at 5.05 p.m. on this Wednesday evening. Near the top story at 5.05 p.m. hour is the decision of that hook to off the hook for Miss Ellen Classified Information is rolled well the FBI Department of Justice with one person closely involved in a year long probe telling Fox News. Moscow, Russia is finding now kind of linked militants in Syria who are using civilians as human shields in the city of Aleppo. President Vladimir Putin said it told as Mark Willie on Wednesday. A student and panel in the strike were arguing shortly before a small pain. They were in crash near the Prime Whitney Tuesday in East Africa, killing one of them, and a high ranking local law enforcement official said Wednesday. Missile again fired a U.S. Navy from Hofa territory, Yemen. Most U.S. stocks were a little changed once he has. Federal Reserve minutes offered the investors a few new insights about the next interest rate increase. Looking at the stocks to now, up 15.54 points at 18,144.20. SP5 up 2.45 points at 2,139.18. And NASDAQ down 7.77 points at 5,239.02. Bang up, the children of King Bumama Abadai, the Thai Monarch River, there's a failure of a unity and stability in a country prone to the political turbulence gathered at this bedtime on Wednesday as the house issued a new report on his deteriorating health. Lawyers represent Salah Abul Sam, the last living suspect in the November 2015 press terror attack, said Wednesday they are ditching him because he refused to talk to protest the prison conditions. When German police officer in the city, a suspect could not send to three Syrian refugees on the phone, desperately trying to divulge the whereabouts of Jabba Abaka, terror suspect and failed Syrian refugee with an escape. Moscow, Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov began in English and not his mother tongue. He doesn't know where the sun made decent as challenging and over exchange student. Tokyo, Japan, needs the defense ministry, Tomoni Inada, is standing firm after opposition party politicians in Turkey ask her to retract mark remarks of the nuclear armament. Crack is Venezuela. Venezuela's highest court ruled the Paris and the Nicholas Mandela can sidestep for the presented 2017 budget today. Opposition control parliament. Washington, more than 40% of the number of Korea's population is at high risk for malnutrition according to think tank. San Salvador, El Salvador, El Salvador's ruling party has proposed allowing women to get abortion in cases of rape, risk for the life of a mother and the fetus is not viable. Panama City, Florida. Donald Trump is turning a criminal party apart that tension in the similar in the Republican Party for years. Shut it down on the government and really bringing in the nature of the default escalated in the outright civil war. Hillary Clinton and frequently often warm at the time spent better worse the Wall Street during the paid speeches before some of the biggest financial powers in the nation was still recovering from the throats and innate crash of an expert's plan. San Francisco Police Chief Greg Sir during a town hall meeting to provide them mission to neighborhood as federal reports cities biased by San Francisco police. A family spread out through over three states ordered pizza for her grandma in Florida to make sure she was all right after they couldn't reach her following Hurricane Matthew. Donald Trump. Washington. During the meeting last month, the Fed stood packed with an interest rate to a lingering concerns that key act members singles details when the meet showed Wednesday. San Antonio, several senatorial police officers will face disciplinary action after appearing in a video with Donald Trump wearing his signature hat while on duty. Riley, North Carolina. North Carolina reported 19 fatalities and then rather rivers in the nation part of the state in the aftermath of Hurricane Matthew. Tallahassee, Florida. A federal judge extended Florida's voter registration deadline for one week after the disruption caused by Hurricane Matthew. Donald Trump's Texas still and may have people scratch their heads. How did he incur such massive losses? What happened to the other tax years? Stanley's, deal doom. Stanley's tool deal measures up. San Francisco, that print a Snapchat is picked up. Banks to lead an initial public offering stock in its first big step toward what is expected to be one of the special market today business over the year. A $1 million donation from Lowe's helps support more than 40 community service projects about to keep America beautiful and create American cleanup. The funds will go toward part of Jim Mobile Space focused on illegal dumping and planting trees. Seattle, Amazon is released on a new on demand. Music streaming service to compete with Spotify, Google, and Apple. New York, or crude oil press has made a U turn in an early. Wednesday's traded after monthly data shows a lingering gap between global supply and demand. Yana, a production cut from members of the Organization of Petroleum Exporter Cut 3, would be needed to meet an algorithm proposal, OPEC's monthly report found. Alexandria, Virginia, logistics and services from Logitech and services from VSA Corporation provide maritime program support for a number of U.S. foreign military sales program customers. Birds are the only living dinosaurs, but their extinct relatives might not have squawked or tweeted like them. Scientists have 
Welcome to the Solar System 2014 UDC 224. That's the price that name and the newest store funded to be just given our solar system system body that that's just 300 miles wide and over 8 billion miles away from our sun. Finds that the famous tomb covers pointed in foot from a and the broad soap sits etching after the death of China's first emperor. Computerized model on the Mars moon Phobos is connected to keeping the Earth safe from asteroids at Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory and announced on Wednesday. A big week all chocolate chip cookie dough and hit ice cream supplies all over the country and now it's hit diet bars. So far, cookie dough ice cream products made by Blue Bell Public Grocery Stores, Nestle, and small companies. People who take calcium supplement may be increased risk for heart to fail build up to platinum arteries, which is a sign of heart disease, the new study found. Boston, San Francisco, most active living city in the U.S. It's about the growing obesity of residents in the U.S. Cities across the country have been promoted with physical activity among city residents of back paths and sidewalks and green spaces. Consumers around the world are increasingly concerned about the nutrition quality and the foods and drinks they consume. That's a major problem for many companies in the soda industry. In a victory for the Florida Democratic Party, a federal judge agreed Wednesday to extend voting registration in the state until October 8th because of the for Hurricane Matthew. Liberty University is a place where Donald Trump still has a lot of support, but his winner mate, Governor Mike Pence of Indiana, was one who seems naturally at home that the Virginia calls it the way the family of New York real estate developers now. An independent conservative who calls himself the opposite of Trump is given a Republican presidential candidate a run for as many years as Senator Well, we wrote his word for more 50 years. And in Nevada, Congress of the last February, Harold Clinton of Kevin Alfred is leaning on Bill Clinton to appear to Casino Mogul Steve Wynn and James Marin, chairman of the MCU of MGM Resorts International, a personal request. All right, looking at some local news from the Outer Sun. Joe Kennedy is officially Foxborough's oldest resident, and now she has a cane to prove it. The 99-year-old Kiernan says she likes Foxborough. It's a nice little town, especially now that she's the oldest there. As Sir Donald Kiernan said, it says Foxborough's oldest resident. She was presented with the town's post cane. I don't know how I quoted with history. In 1999, the Boston Post created a promotion when the commission and the creation of hundreds of post canes to use full top capital and many canes were distributed in towns on all New England states with the exception of Vermont and Connecticut. And Foxborough Historical Commission Chairman Mark Fenwick says he didn't like Yankee fans, but something like that. Out of our schools, officials contend with the latest round of standardized test scores, which shows that city schools are getting good results with less money than similar districts. Out of our, a man convicted last month of yelling at boys playing in Pokemon Go and Veterans Memorial Park this summer in downtown November was sent to jail to his age for a 34-year-old mother. Boston, Ernest Hemingway. Was a pack rat that saved everything approaching a fan that had lived back on. U.S. and Cuban officials and scholars have been working to give a preserve artifacts to their former state of Cuba that they had been to set. Well, it was eliminated the Calico Legacy at uh, Form 1 State of the John F. Kennedy President of Museum in Boston. Hemingway expressed from both countries and scored the determination to save a book, letters, fishing rods, marks, and animal trophies, and more than a claim offered the left behind Havana. Their collaboration in the scores that now in a new era of U.S. government normalization taken with the form included. TV host Bob Villa, son of Cuban immigrants, who has been restored to Hemingway home and known as Pink, a bigger lookout from Jonah Villa, where U.S. President Jim McGovern of Massachusetts, and Edward Alfonso, director of Cuba's Missouri of Hemingway, and Susan Wynn, former curator of Jim A. Lovers, here in a Hemingway collection. Hemingway for a little way, eventually leaving me on a rich archive that included a passport and Christmas cards. Wynn said, Boston Travel website, trip advisor, saying the thing is stand against animal precipitation by no longer certain bookings are attractive where travelers can make. Physical contact with Captain Wild on them also and dangerous species. Peter Channel News Time is 5.13 on this Wednesday afternoon and Wednesday evening, and it is time now for a New England Intelligence Report. In Boston at Lennon Oman Street in Mattapan, smoke showed a fire in the air of a two and a half story wood frame drill, and all arguments were out of the structure. And now look at your sports at 5.14. Ronda Rousey will end in a year-long hiatus from Friday when she returns to the UFC 207 against women's bantamweight champion Amanda Nunes in December. Mark J. Spears reacts to the news that Falcon Sport Anthony Davis is expected to miss 10 to 15 days when an ankle injury has this effect to New Orleans. In event of trial, it would be hard to imagine back when the Miami Heat are coming off to contact the Chiefs a few seasons ago that LeBron James and Wayne Wade were. Both lead the franchise's free agents in short order as cast wanted but couldn't afford Wade. And Jeremy Hill has passed but Peter Chill News Time is now 514 on this Wednesday evening, and it's coming up a traffic and transit report. Beep, beep. Let's take an MMT where red line trains with trains delays today between JFK, UMass, and North Quincy. Commuter Rail, Whistler Train 522, 345 p.m. from Whistler's Opera, 15 20 minutes past between Framingham and South Station. Please board inbound. 
Whistle Line Trains in the Outbound Platforms are friendly and about Wellesley Farm Station until 7.30 p.m. Please board our Outbound Whistle Line Trains in the Outbound Platforms at Wellesley Farm Framing Station until 7.30 p.m. Cable Train 286 is canceled today. All 28 passengers can take MBTA bus 136 to part with the depot at 6.5 p.m. Cable Train 295, 6.5 p.m. from North Station is canceled today. Consider checking Train 219, 6.5 p.m. out on its route to Havre. Cable Train 294 is canceled today. All 28 passengers can take MBTA bus 136 to part with the depot at 5.50 p.m. Cable Line Train 293, 4.40 p.m. from North Station is canceled today. Consider taking Train 215, making all local stops in Havre Station. Lowell train 393, 4.20 p.m. out on the stop and 10 50 minutes past gap between North Station and Lowell. Newburyport train 167, 4.30 p.m. from North Station stop and 10 50 minutes past gap between North Station and Newburyport and Newburyport Walker train 193, 4.40 p.m. from North Station to depart North Station 5 50 minutes late due to early mechanical problems. All right, let's take a look at highways and bowies at New England on this. Wednesday evening, let's say off down in Kayaki, where 95 on us. Stop on Saturday, this back up from 79 and Noah. Walk down to Greenwich, 95 to Northbound, side back from 79 to Bridgeport, and 95 with both ends back to West Haven to New Haven, and 95 with a stop bounce back to Brentford area towards New Haven, 91 and a stop bounce on Lowe's Road, Route 95, Merritt Parkway East, bound side is back to Newark, all the way at the Fairfield, and Merritt Parkway West bound side back to Hammond, New Haven, and through the Stamford stretches, Interstate A4 East bound side is back to Newtown, and also hit the brakes again on the West bound side of A4 on the Waterbury stretch. A4 westbound side is back to Hartford to downtown Hartford around West Stafford. A4 eastbound side is back to West Stafford to downtown Hartford, Connecticut. 91 on both ends is back to 291 all the way at the Route 2. And 91 and southbound side is backed up all the way at the Winds Locks. 395 is looking good from New London, Ohio to Putnam, Connecticut. Add in Springfield in the vicinity. 91 and the southbound side is backed up from 391 and Springfield all the way at the 291. 91 on both ends is back from 57 all the way at the 291 in downtown Springfield. Here. And out in Central Massachusetts, Route 2 westbound side of Lowe's on Fitchburg, stretching in Hippie, and westbound number Route 2 on Fort Devens. 290 on Stub and Go for the Shrewsbury, stretching in Hippie, and for 190 Route 9 in Worcester. Out in Rhode Island, out in Providence and vicinity, 146 on the southbound side, it is back to 146A. 146 on the northbound side, it is back to 99 all the way at 146A. 295 both ends at Lowe's Route 95 and in Annabelle. 295 on the northbound side, it is back to 37 of Route 12 in Cranston. 146 on the southbound side is back to the before 95 in downtown Providence. 95 on the southbound side is back to the protected the downtown Providence. 95 on the northbound side is back to the 37 of the walkway at the downtown Providence. 195 on the westbound side is back to the Seacock area at the downtown Providence. Out in the East Bay Bridge, the Jameson Newport Bridge is looking good for but the Mantle Bridge is at slowing both ends. Stop out in the Cape, Route 6 on the westbound side is back to the around Harwich Stretch. 20 in the eastbound side is around Warren Bridge, around Route 25. 95 minutes southbound side back with 120 Kent to the route 95 and out of about 24 stomach go for 120 Kenton all the way at the route 495 and Ram. Route 3 and southbound side back around Marshfield and Route 3 and both ends back to the Brain Street stretch. Mass back on the westbound side it is backed up on both ends from East Boston to South Boston and Mass back westbound back to the also back tolls all over the way out to Milford Seven Expressway southbound side backed up from Denham all the way out to Route 24 and Randolph. 24 both ends. 120 in both ends back around the Braintree split, and 120 not bounds backed up all the way after Route 28 and Randolph and 24. So, it's Presbyterian Southbound side is backed up from Dutchess all the way after the Braintree split, 93 in both ends is backed up from Mass Ave all the way at the downtown Boston, and 93 in Southbound side it is backed up around the Stem, stem Storm Stretch, 93 in the northbound side it is sold from Zaken Bridge in Boston all the way after the Thuin. Route 1 in the northbound side backed up to Chelsea and Rivier. Route 2 in eastbound side it is backed up around the on to down to Belmont, 120 on both ends is backed up from Route 9 and Wolseley all the way up to Round. The Mass Pike out in Weston, 120 on both ends back on the Wall Family Route 2 Lexington, 120 on the southbound side back on the Round the Brown Stretch, 120 on the northbound side back on 4225 Lexington all the way up to Route 95 and Peabody, 120 on the southbound side back on the Denver all the way up to Route 95. Route 3 on the northbound side is backed up from Burlington all the way up to Lowell, 495 on the northbound side is backed up from 9 and Westbury all the way up to Marlboro, 495 on the southbound side back on Route 20 Route 9. 120 stop outside back on the Denver side, Route 95 and Peabody, 495 in the northbound side is backed up from Route 2 in Littleton all the way out to Route 3 in the Tooksbury, 495 hit the break name in a long stretch. 495 stop outside back on the Tooksbury all the way out to Route 3 in Lowell, Route 3 in the northbound side back on the Burlington all the way out to Route 113 in Lowell, and 93 in the northbound side it is back from 125 in Andover up into Methuen. Service so down in 70 New Hampshire. Everett's Trent Pack stop outside back on the Manchester New Hampshire stretch. 
Route 3 on the northbound side of Beckner, the Merrimack stretch. 93 on the northbound side of Loso, when they're in the Webster stretch. And then 93 on the southbound side of Loso after 293 on Manchester and Webster. 95 on the southbound side of Loso at Route 101 in Hampton. Every Spawn the turn out on the northbound side of Loso, just at Route 4 in Durham, New Hampshire. 93 on the southbound side of Loso at 393 to Interstate 89 in Concord, New Hampshire. 195 on the eastbound side of Loso at the main turn back up at Sackville, Maine. Route 1 on the southbound side of Loso in Brunswick, Maine. A I nine one the south bound side of Lulso after the Canadian War up in northern Vermont. A seven the south bound side of Lulso at Champlain, New York, round Route eleven and Ottawa fifty nine the north bound side of Lulso after the Canadian border and some Quebec and towards Montreal. And here's A seven the north bound side of Beckton McCallney up near Detroit. Route seven on the west bound side of Beckton and Detroit stretch and New York State three east bound Lulso and Chattanooga. Peter Chell News time is five twenty one on this. Wednesday evening, and it's time now for a weather report and the latest on Hurricane Nicole. Same location, 29 to the north, 66.6 west. Mass was 110 miles an hour and no, moment north at 10 miles an hour here. And public advisory, Nicole Strain is the take name on Bermuda. Hurricane warning in effect by Bermuda. Hurricane warning means that hurricane conditions are expected somewhere in the water area. Preparation to protect life and property should be rushed to completion. For some information, the Spencer area, please monitor the product station by National Meteorological Service at 5 p.m. at Atlanta Center Time. The large of Hurricane Nicole was located in the latitude 20 and 42 to north, line to 66.6 west. And Nicole is moving toward the north near 10 miles an hour and it turns toward the north, northeast, and an increase in force speed is expected tonight. The northeast turn with an additional increase in force speed as forecast on Thursday. A forecast track that co-op the Hurricane Nicole pass over the near the Bermuda on Thursday. And that's the same with under near Chris near 1 in 10 miles an hour. Guess in some slight train minutes possible tonight and early Thursday. And Nicole's forecast to be at Near Maine to Hurricane Street when it approaches Bermuda. Hurricane enforcement at the hours of 45 miles from the center and total work to enforcement at the hours of 16 miles and estimated minimum set pressure 962 mil miles 20 for 41 in inches. When hurricane conditions are expected to begin on Bermuda Thursday morning with troughs and conditions expected to begin this evening. And storm surge, a dangerous storm surge will raise with water levels as much as 68 feet above normal tide levels in Bermuda. That surge will be accompanied by a large and destructive waves. Rainfall Nickel is expected to produce total rain increments of 48 inches over Bermuda by Thursday. Swells associated with the nickel will affect the Bermuda during the next few days. The swells likely create damage to conditions and whip currents. Please refer products being issued by the Bermuda Weather Service and outside tornadoes are possible on Bermuda tonight and early Thursday. All right, seven day forecast it goes like this. It was a wonderful Wednesday in the weather department here in New England. Perfect sun, manageable temperatures, it was. Perfect for any outdoor activity. Right, seven day forecast goes like this. But tonight, we're going to have some patch of through up to 2 a.m. Patch of up to 5 a.m. Oh, wow. Increased clouds to lower 48 degrees. Supper about 5 months been coming in the evening for Thursday. Patch of drizzle. With a slight chance of shadow before noon. And then a slight chance of shadow at 3 p.m. Punchy probable for 10 months. Most guys about 600 degrees. Covering becoming southwest and finding that mouth in the morning. Just paid to 20%. So that a chance of trace shadow main before 11 p.m. Most guys go. Then grab to come and most guys go back. 43 degrees in southwest are about 5 to 9 miles coming in northwest of Manila. Chin subspace is 40%. New percent less than 10 inch possible for Friday. Sunday, the coast cover 50 down about 32 degrees. North about 5 to 8 miles down for Saturday. Sunday, most coast cover 57 about 35 degrees. Sunday, Sunday, tobacco is about 63 about 47 degrees. Monday, church is afternoon. Pot seats in the most coast cover 69 about 51 degrees. Just based on 30%. Tuesday, pot seats in the park cover 69 about 50 degrees. And for Wednesday, most coast cover 68 degrees. Currently, not near it is a fair sky. Then we have a temperature of. 62 degrees with a humidity of 59%. And that is going to be it for the Peter Channel. 80 News at 5 5 p.m. on this October 12, 2016. On Wednesday, I'm Peter. So we have a good evening. Goodbye. Today. Do not see you at 11 o'clock. We're right now. I hope you have a good evening.